got some great action for you today. It's Easter weekend, and it's also 420 tomorrow, so we're going to be having a lot of happy people tomorrow. They get to eat chocolate and smoke and... And... And they'll keep and smoke and eat, eat chocolate. The same day. Yeah, right? Throw the diets out the window. Yep. Still don't compare to Thanksgiving, though. Um, yeah. Depends. You know, uh -oh. what you're fixing, and yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But then I'm always fixing everything. So we would like to remind our fans, if you are TPNN people, make sure you TP them and away from the barricade. We do have snipers on premises, and I'm sure your fans won't be happy landing down at the bottom of the sim. Well, let's just put it to that. We won't go into detail. No, but please try to make no. certain you're dressed. I mean, we like the bunny outfits. They're cute, you know, but... At least make certain you have a top and bottom on. You know, your bits are covered. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it is 2 o'clock when that tron fires up. Make as much noise as possible. Look at me, I'm a bunny. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to APW Ignition. I am John Crossett, and beside me, Dixie X. Yes, and we are live from the Mobian Dome, the temporary home of APW, while Sunset Arena V.2 is being currently constructed on. Yeah, unfortunately, because, kinda, yeah, there bad was accident. an electrical fire and the arena burnt down and it was a whole type of mess. Yeah, it was. And Scott had nothing to do with it. Yeah, I heard Phoenix partied a little too hard and she got playing with the flamethrower and it hit the electrical box.
Anyways, are we ready? I'm ready. I know I'm ready. You know, I can't wait. I want to see what's going on. You know, I want to see all these people in here um, wrestling, and I want to see uh, band from ringside. And here is our lovely referee today. Look. And it seems somebody got a little impatient. Hello, Phoenix. So let's see what Phoenix has got to say. Finally, right. the bird of prey, Love Phoenix, has risen to the highest peak. Last week, I defeated Arcana for the Women's United States Championship. Not one woman in the back has come close. Nobody except me. You see, I can truly say I've defeated the best, and now here I stand at the top of the food chain. The ring is now my nest, and I have settled in it, and you do not want to step in my nest. Apparently she has made it known that the ring is her territory. Hey, now she fought that ring in that ring fair and square. Now come on. So go ahead. Try and face me. I don't care who. Uh, the lights are going off again. Boring. Ooh. Uh, looks like we've got an answer. And Missy started shouting, boring. Why are you boring me?
and then Phoenix is coming back. So you are who I'm defend going to defend my title against. A fan? Oh, that's not just a fan. And she responds to scenes. I've seen Homer Simpson talk more stupid than you. Oh. This is Oh, nice. words are flying already. It's just coming back. Do you know who I am? I think we all know who she is. She jumped been jumped up the barricade twice and attacked uh -huh. a few of our wrestlers. Look at my face. You should know who I am. And Phoenix just went Layer uh, just went dead quiet. I'm the most talked about woman in the history of APW. Uh, I don't know if she's the most talked about. I think Honey and Anarchy might have gotten them uh, well, beat with the first uh, Ultimate X. Yeah, I'm thinking she's coming back. And I should care why. I don't. I mean, I don't see you doing anything but becoming a thorn to my, Michelle's, and Nick's side. Ooh. Missy's coming back. Hell, all of wrestling. Phoenix comes back. I'm going to put an end to that tonight, though. Oh? Huh? So Missy comes back. Really? Why are you defending Michelle so much? Oh, I get it. Your big mama. Oh shit! Um, shit's about to get real, <laughs> real quick. That's gonna burn. Phoenix is sitting here. Okay, I see you got jokes. Here's a hilarious one. And Missy's coming back. Oh, here. shit! Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh that's real bad. He's got a match. Oh! Shots fired across the world, and Phoenix going to town on Misty right now. Oh, wow. I mean, talk about boom! She just. No, that was a, my no, 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 no. That was a boom. That was just like boom. <laughs> that was kaboom! Wow! And those elbow strikes, Misty, oh. literally getting it taken to her right now. Uh, I think Phoenix is a little take off. Um, I would say more than ticked off. I would say pissed off. Well, yeah. But I'm trying to be nice. God, and look at her. She's just going after that rib area. I told you, I'm just trying to be nice now. Okay, I'm out of there. Wait a minute, don't they, aren't they... Yeah, part of Misty's contract stipulation, if she defeated Michelle, she would get Phoenix, and she's getting all the Phoenix right now. Oh, yeah? Y'all do know that uh, Miss Misty is six foot and she's about 150 pounds. She's from Carolina, South Carolina, that is. Yes, while, Fe while Lyra Phoenix, our women's champion, is 6'7", 228 pounds from Liverpool, England and that's a big woman too. Tall for certain. Kind of makes you wonder what they've been feeding her. Liver? <laughs> I don't know. Uh oh. Missy's got uh, Phoenix's knee around that rope. Ref up There's to three. Missy's got to the count of five, four. Four. 
Oh, she broke it off. Not her leg, but... <laughs> well... Uh, anyways! Oh! Corner splash! Misty finally able to gain some ground! Oh, baseball slide knocking Phoenix right out of ring. Did you see how hard she hit her back? No. I did oh. from the ca uh, I did from the monitor. I mean that mat's not very thick. And ever since Misty came here, she's uh -oh. been on a. Vicious streak trying to hurt this me. Is oh! I'm glad we're set far enough back. Uh, apparently not. But I'm kind of wondering how far back we're going to have to be. Well, apparently we were back far enough that uh, I think Phoenix may have hit her head off of the uh, little ignition sign here on the front. And a spear. Ooh. Rough up to six. They better be careful so they both don't get disqualified. Yeah, but see, Miss that ring, so. You know, and a reminder that last oh. week, Fe <laughs> you remember that Feast or Fired match, right? We had back oh, when yes. we were on that boat. Yes, I do. Cause, uh, one Phoenix of won briefcases. that championship after she cashed her briefcase in. Uh-huh. Sure did. Because we had a briefcase go over the side of that ship. So, you know, we don't know what's going on. Apparently not. And apparently your phone's saying hi to us as well. I know it. Miss Misty going to the top now. Oh, actually that was Michelle. She's trying to figure out uh, what's going on right now. I told her just to hush and just to watch the back, you know, videos and see what's and going on. And Alex and Phoenix using Alex to climb up on her. Oh! Oh, she missed! Oh, no. And Lyra was that Wildfowl Lariat. Uh -uh. I hope Alex is okay. And she's picking her up behind. She said, you'll get the firestorm. Uh -oh. oh, she's picking her up. Was she, wait a minute, was she... Dude, oh! A rainmaker! Shit! Did you see the power of that clothesline? Oh it my! Literally set Misty head over heels. <gasps> One, two, three! Oh! Ladies and gentlemen. Your winner and still women's U.S. champion is Lyra Phoenix. And no help from Michelle and Nick. Ooh, you know they back there ticked off. Like cake? Uh-oh. And Alex is not happy. 
Uh, no, she's right. Here you go, Phoenix. Looks good on you. Now, John. This is one good match. You know what? Seeing this match. Wait. Uh oh. Phoenix is shouting over here. You'll never get this off of me. Oh! We get her in the ring and burn her on the stage. Wow. Okay, hang on a minute. I'm getting some information fed to me. Apparently, we've got an update on the condition of Damien Hex. Um, apparently, after that light fixture fell on him, he's got some sort of amnesia and he doesn't remember ever being a wrestler. You're kidding. Is it that no, bad? I'm not kidding you. I wish I was. I mean, I know Scott went to the hospital with him last week. And he's been spending a lot of time, you know, there and everything. And I think that's where he's at today is he went back up there. But I told him, I said, well, you know, I need to come up here and help him. Because I promised you I'd come and help you. And I'm being called to the back, so you may well, have to you solo this one. That's all right. I don't mind. Well, you head to the back. And I'm glad you got those updates because, uh... Yes, Scott's been very upset, so. Now, y'all just have me while I'm up here, and uh, John's heading to the back, so... Y'all get enjoy. Because we're getting ready to have our second match. Which is a one fall, ten minute time limit. Xavier Dials versus El Huracan. So, we're going to have some uh, interesting match here. Because uh, Xavier is my bodyguard. I am kind of rooting for him and can't help it. Got all these pretty lights. I love watching these. Coming out now, Xavier Dials standing in here at six foot eight, weighing in at three hundred and fifty pounds from Detroit, Michigan. So we're ready. At least I am. Come on, y'all, make some noise.
Now coming out now should be is our Huracan. And there he is. Now El Huracan stands in at six for one, weighing in at 180 pounds from Puerto Rico. All right, he deserves an applause, I suppose. I'll be nice. So let's get this match started. Uh, this don't look a little fair. For some reason, this does not seem fair. Six foot eight, six foot one. I don't know. This don't seem fair. But I mean, hey. <laughs> it don't always have to be. Well, hello, Captain Falcon. Glad you could join us. Oh, oh, hi there. Well, there, Dixie. Uh, well, let's see. What what do we have here? We have uh, Xavier Dallas and El Huracano Famoso. Yeah. All right, you're gonna need to, you know, pass your card because I just got here. Sorry, I was. I know it. it. Was, uh, and I was, uh, I'm so glad traffic. you decided to come and help me. Yeah, no problem. No problem. But yeah, they just started, so. Let's see what's going on, and of course, you know, Xavier turns around and Irish whips uh, Huracan, so yeah. Jesus Ooh. Christ, yeah. Yeah, I, I feel sorry, I feel sorry for that guy. <laughs> yeah, because it looks like Xavier is just, you know, be being a monster compared to him. He's just what? whooping him. I mean, he's the perfect bodyguard. I do admit he is, but Jesus. <laughs> it looks like Xavier just, you know, pulled him right into the middle of the ring, and Xavier is tall. Jesus Christ, well, six he's foot six eight. Six foot eight, but now, you know, El Huracan, he's six foot one, though. So not too much of a difference, really. Uh, but here's the kicker. 200, uh, 150, 108 pounds compared to 350. And how the hell did El Huracano drop Xavier with a drop kick? <laughs> um, caught him off balance. Jesus Christ. Now that I did find out, you know, he, he does have a problem. <laughs> uh, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, but Xavier is just too damn big. What? It ain't that he no. And oh. Jesus Christ, yeah, that was the biggest boot I ever seen in my life. Yeah, it is, ain't it? I don't know. Scott's got pretty big feet too, so. And and Xavier is just not letting up as he just picks up uh, a her kind of a scoop slam, and he's just going to town. Mm. They'll come. They'll come to be from Detroit for nothing. <laughs> That's right. And wait, Ooh. wait a second. Uh -huh. The lights just wait. The lights just went out. Um, wait, what's going on? Wait. I don't what? know. What do you mean? Wait, you know what? The lights did go out. Yeah. Wait a minute. Now they're wait. flashing again. What the hell? Wait. Wait a second. Who's coming what's out? What's this? I don't know. I've never heard the song before, so I don't know what to expect. No! No, no, no! Uh, 
What? Wait, what, what do you mean, though? No, 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 no. Dixie? No, no, no. Dixie, are you alright? No! Dixie, ca ca I'm... Dixie, calm down. Calm down. No. Hey, hun, calm down. Calm down. I don't no. know what the hell. Like, no. like what's you, going you, on? You, you haven't been around. That, that, that. Oh, is, shit. It's Abaddon. That's the one! With all, with his manager, with his manager, Franny Warcliffe. Wait, my thing is, how the hell can Franny, that little woman, could control such a beast like this? And she has the boobs. No, 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 no. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think it's more than that. Was uh, Ab wait, Abaddon's in the middle of the ring, and he's just looking at Xavier. Wait a second. Wait a minute. What's going on? Wait. I I, I don't know. Um, he's looking down at her. Wait, what? Wait, he's not going to. He's, uh... he's looking down at her. Wait, he's not going to attack El Hurricane, is he? I don't know. But how? When? I, I, I have no I idea. Mean... Okay, I have no idea. Holy shit! <laughs> He just went after Xavier! He just ah! curls like the hell- No! He just curls like the hell out of Xavier! Oh my god, he's just no! going to town as a ref- The ref called for a disqualification, and it looks like the winner of this match is- no, Well, by disqualification will be Xavier Dallas, but he's just getting handed by Avatar right now. Wait a minute, but why- And- I, I I don't know, but Abaddon has the power to, as he just clotheslined Xavier over the ropes. Jesus! <laughs> oh, mercy. <laughs> this, this is perhaps, this is called, oh my god. I guess, I guess you could say, uh, why don't you pick up someone your own size, Xavier Dolls, as he's, as Abaddon is just taking it, taking it to Xavier right now. <laughs> Oh my. my god. I mean, the only loss Abaddon has ever gotten was from Tyler Corvas, and I swear, I think that was by blind luck. But he's going after Xavier Dallas right now. I'm going to tell you right now, Abaddon is huge. I've seen him before. I just didn't remember that song. But, Jesus. Yeah. A I mean, Abaddon. When you have something that, like that, you don't ever forget it. I know, and wait, it looks like he, he, Abaddon is dragging Xavier to, wait, is he dragging Xavier to the back? Oh my god. I, th th this what? is, oh no. Okay, wait a minute, he's uh, dragging... Yes, he's, he's dragging, dragging Xavier to the back. By his neck. What, what, what the hell is going on? Wait, wait, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, this, 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 this is not no good, idea. this is not good. I don't know either. Well, El Horkano is out here. It looks like he's he is hurt. He's hurt, but it looks like he doesn't want any part of that. Is he going? Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Abaddon and Xavier are at the corner of the uh, stage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh wait. Oh no. Oh no. Abaddon's not going to. Oh! <laughs> oh he just, he just choked Sam Xavier Dallas right off the stage onto the ground. No! Oh my God. <laughs> Oh brother, dude! Oh my God, uh, Xavier! Xavier's hurt. That 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 was a high fall. That that that's this is not good for Xavier. Oh no, God. that's not. But 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 what? But what? But what issued this this act of Abaddon? I mean, I understand he's a big guy. He, he's he's just a big guy full of mystery. We just don't know anything, we don't even know much about Abaddon. All that we know is that he's just destruction incarnated. That's all that we know. Okay. And, and Xavier's not moving. No, he's not. Somebody needs to pull him. Yeah, yeah. Do we have a do we, do we have an ambulance? Backstage. Do we have an ambulance or something? Yeah, because Xavier's not moving. And that was a pretty high pull, pull. Somebody needs to come and pull him backstage. They gonna grab him from the bottom? Um, uh, can I be someone from the back? Because I cannot lift that guy up for my life. Oh, I, I weigh like a bug fish. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, what, what, what try calls on? Hey, can... Oh, wait. 
What? Wait, is it? Wait, what? What? Why is Abaddon here? Wait, Ab is Abaddon done? No, he's not. What the hell? <laughs> he just come back out here with another choke slam. Wait, and he's driving he's dragging Xavier to back again. He's, dra he's dragging Xavier to back again. I I think that's I think that's what's going on. Oh, well, I um, um I know we want I to call Abby. Yeah. Um, yes. Yeah. Um, um where, where where's he take where's he taking him? Oh, he, he, I know he's taking him to back, but some some can someone? No, stop Alex, him? I don't want to go stop him. <laughs> can, can 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 someone call Tyler Corvus? Like he's the only person that has ever defeated him. But I I, I don't know. I I I I, yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, Tyler did it. I I I don't know. Well, oh dear. Um, um well, we'll have I'll, to get I'll, an update later. Yeah. All right. Uh, well, we're gonna move on to match number three, as it seems. So yeah. I'm gonna say. Uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, wow. the following is a singles match scheduled for one fall with a ten minute time limit. So, introducing first. From Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 245 pounds at high of 6 foot 4, he is the, Izer the irresistible one, Kurt Bombastic. At least I hope the back was ready. Yeah, there or they're gonna troll me, cause lately a couple feds have been trolling me. Yeah, I think they're trolling me. Does someone have the wah 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 gesture? Because if someone does, just play it. Just play it now. I'm afraid I've got some bad news. That works also. <laughs> All right, now are we ready for our sponsors, Captain Falcon? Oh, oh I'm we're just, just gonna get. I'm stunned. Okay, I am well, just totally, I'm totally, totally stunned. Well, I am too because first thing, Abaddon I mean, was a big dude. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Let's go directly into our sponsors. You want to go first? Certainly. Um, we are sponsored by Teres, the Nova Interviews. Do you want to learn more about your favorite wrestler? Go to the blog spot and let me copy that because that is definitely the place to go to learn about your favorite wrestlers because they do have weekly updating blog with the new wrestler being interviewed and over 40 already with tons of veterans in the SL community. So please go to the blog spot and take a look at Tyress Nova interviews. Big baby get like me animations. Don't you ever want to fill the pan with a little something, something to boost your appetite custom needs for your boob set? Then contact the great one Derek Colt, or come down to Big Baby Get Like Me Animations for the best in Japanese, MMA, and old school moves. So if you want the best in animation, just get like me. And that's right, Big Baby. Also, we have, have Rainbow Kids Productions. Do your kids love fashion as much as you do? Then stop by Rainbow Kids Productions where they have fashion shows that are made and designed especially for kids. From the toddly do to tiny tot or even just regular kids because, of course, you know, this is SL. Anything is possible. They will show you various and interesting new styles in the kids' fashion world today. So for more information, contact Sky Sharple or Macy Miles or even drop by the office at the Little Dreams Mall. And we will get that up for you. And right here it is. Because if you guys want that link, you know, on, put it on your map. Teleport there. Go shop. Take your little ones to shop. I do. Unfortunately, I spend too much money. Yeah. Hey, are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Wildfire! Did that catch your attention? Yes. Team Wildfire, one of the lean video production groups on Second Life, not only makes blazing video entrances, but now can be caught on the weekends live streaming classes at www.twitch.tv slash team underscore wildfire. From behind the video scenes to music editing to absolutely everything. So come check it out. If you want to know more about it? Contact the Firebird, Lyra Phoenix, or yours truly, Captain Falcon, for details. 
Team Wildfire, blaze your mind one video at a time. Ain't that the truth? I mean, they're good too. That, that's the best part. They are good. Now, also, we would like to thank Intoxication Tattoo and Sport for sponsoring this event. Intoxication Tattoo and Sport is your source for high quality sports. All right. And it looks like that's that's pretty damn old because, hey, the uh, Seahawks and Broncos already face each other at the Super Bowl. Anyway, moving on. Blackheart's Designs, the number one stop for all your texturing work. Need them for cars, bikes, logos? Blackheart's, Blackheart Designs can do it for you. Contact Broly Yakubu for pricing and details. Uh, Dixie, you there? Um, I guess I'll take over from here. Alright, Enchanted Visions Photography. Want to capture that special moment forever? At Enchanted Visions, they bring you good quality f photos for affordable prices. For more information, please contact Sky Sharple or Red Aurora Finlers or stop by your office in the Little Jeans Mall. Right and there, your Exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know, the next revolution of S. NB is here, the home of this sim. We do thank our sponsors, each and every one of them, and we do thank the sim for sponsoring us tonight. The Sonic Night of Babylon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we, 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 we do thank you, ladies and gentlemen, as we move on to our third match. So, if the back is not too busy trolling the hell out of me... Alright. Are we ready for our next match? I believe we do. So, introducing first, from the hometown of Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 245 pounds and high of 6 foot 4, he is the irresistible one, Kurt Bombastic. Ugh. Oh, did I say that? Say what you want about this guy, like him or hate him, but he could basically take anyone to town. Regardless of what their size is. Uh huh. I still say him and Maven was in there in cahoots together. Even if they were, I mean, you got you got handed to Kurt. He does have skill. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Okay. He has skill of throwing somebody over top of the ropes. Uh huh. Sure. Oh, you're just mad. <laughs> yes, I am upset. Can't help it. Oh yeah, brother, you're going down. <laughs> oh god, ladies and gentlemen, if you are on mic, please be off mic, as only the commentators and the wrestlers may be on mic at this time. Even though, that was hilarious. High five, bro. <laughs> I'm afraid I've got some bad news. Man, looks like Kurt has some bad news for us. As uh, always, uh, introducing next his opponent from Osaka, Japan, weighing at 215 pounds, a uh, height of six foot three. He is John Crossett. We haven't seen this guy since he got injured by well, the same man, <laughs> Kurt Bombastic. <laughs> I mean, ladies and gentlemen, we haven't seen John Costa here in a while, so please make some noise for his, uh, for his another return. Ain't that the truth? There we go. Now the crowd's alive. That's right.
It looks like Kurt was just performing a high gymnastics jump, trying to get ready. Yeah. Yes, he's that good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, we could expect anything from this match. But, I'm gonna tell you right now, John and Kurt have, well, they've both faced each other plenty of times, so they both pretty much know each, other, know each other's moveset. Uh, yeah, but you gotta think, now John is coming back, you know, he just spent a whole lot of time in Japan, and everything, so, yeah, come on. Well, well, ladies and gentlemen, the bell is just rung, as Kurt is at, as Kurt and, uh, John, they look like they're ready to go at it, but it looks like they're in no rush. As uh, John goes into his uh, his fighting stance, Ooh. as th uh, John cross it, he could be going for his fighting stance as Kirk goes right for round two, son. <laughs> oh man! It looks like Kirk, Kirk is not even taking him seriously. He's just walking left and right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man! So and oh, strong elbow to got by John. Ooh. That's what you. And kicked to gut by John Crossan also. And looks like, uh, looks like John's taking to him. He goes for a nice round hot kick to midsection. They go for a dose. Leg yeah. kicks, right kick. Uh, Jesus you know, Christ. I think he's really looking to get some uh, revenge against oh. uh, Kurt right now. Yeah, it's Kurt himself with a stiff elbow strike, but John is just going to town. He's just going for that MMA combo. <laughs> oh, yeah. Jesus. But, you know, I mean, really, come on. You know, this is kind of a little bit of a robbery. Yeah, but I think John just wants straight-up revenge. <laughs> I think he's been training all this time just for this. And it looks like Kerr is like, oh, you want to play that game? <laughs> oh, boy. And it looks like, oh, here comes Kurt. Is he just getting up? Oh. I mean, not taking anything away from Kurt, but John pretty much laid it, laid him out. As yeah, so oh, Kurt goes for a headlock as well. Nice combination right there. The, these two have, these two have a very unique move set that you won't, you won't really find from most wrestlers. You just won't. Both of them have yeah. some sort of MMA background. But John with the Muay Thai strikes as he shows off his Muay Thai skills. And he's just laying in those kicks as holy hell kicked him right across his chin with that spinning roundhouse. <laughs> mm, yeah. Wow. And, and yeah, uh, as Kurt says, as I said, oh, but wait, oh! And with those Ooh. double knees, those clinching double knee strikes by Kurt. Oh. So it beats her, and there goes Kurt with no double knee strike. This Maybe is that's it. what we need this to do: take Kurt out by his knees. Oh! I'm gonna tell you right. I would say right now, this isn't this isn't some type of wrestling match. This is a straight up fight. Well, yeah, it is. Oh, it looks like Kurt has tossed him into the ropes. Says, "Oh, the way he's here comes John with a classic, very classic Luther's press, as he just pounds the." Pounds the hell out, Kurt. Oh my! <laughs> it looks like it looks like John. John's a little tired, but he, he's just taking it to Kurt. He doesn't really care. It looks uh. like Kurt. It looks like Kurt is like good. Like he says, "Okay, brat." So I don't know what what's going to be going on now. And. <laughs> I don't know, Alex. The boxing rules. I don't think they care if it's a boxing match. I don't think they care if it's an yeah. anime match. I don't care if they think it's if there's a death match. I think they they just want to go to town as John Cross goes for a wrist lock and goes for a hammer lock combo right there and there. As John is going, John is you know, I says as I said, take it to Kurt. That's what he has to do. And oh, nice kick right to the midsection as John works works over Kirk's legs as gut with those vicious kick strikes. Oh. It looks like John go for another oh. wrist lock. And wait a second, it, what? Whoa, what, what was that? that? Oh. Was, was that, was that, was that, a arm, was that a armor choke kick? I, I don't know. 
I don't know either, but that looked like it hurt. John's showing yeah. us something new. Just a tad little bit. Definitely. Looks like John <laughs> picks up. Her. Uh, yeah, Dixie. Uh, what I said about bringing dogs to work. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, as Dixie tries, you know, uh, get her get leg out there. Whoa, wait a second! Kurt coming out of nowhere, grabbing John's leg and hitting the dragon screw shitbreaker. As Kurt is just stopping the hell out of, out of John right there. <laughs> It looks like Kurt is. Kurt is. I think he's focusing on John's legs right now. At least that's what I think. I mean, I could say different. But Kurt just stands over John as John is. He's laid out and he doesn't know where the hell he is right now. I know. Ah. Oh. So, how's the dog? Dogs are good. <laughs> I put him in his cage. Uh, looks like uh, Kurt is tired, but John's down on the floor, so I don't, I don't know. J John, John has been looking very impressive so far in this match, but Kurt has been neutralizing John at every aspect that he can. This is a match and a half. I'm sorry, these oh. two are very equally. Equally matched. Oh uh, yeah, and we and that is kind of that's pretty hard to say when you're up when when it's two MMA fighters because you usually usually there's always someone that's gonna have that slight difference as it looks like. Ooh. Uh. As it looks like freaking courage just going for those vicious stops, just stopping the hell out of Chum right now with those repeating stops. Oh, I know. Oh. Wow. I mean, Kurt just picks up John like he's nothing. I mean, seriously, it looks like it looks like this might be for for John as. Oh, wait a second! John come out of nowhere with an inverted headlock backbreaker. Ooh. Oh my god! And oh, John with a senton right on top of Kurt. Oh. So you think Kurt's alright? <laughs> Not. I mean, I mean, every time Kurt goes up against John, it's always an impressive, an impressive match. Yeah. I was, uh, but but Kurt does have a little bit over, uh, uh, just slightly, a little bit over John. Oh. Because he because Kurt has won the last match. Mm, and, and against those two, and I think I think Kurt went and broke his arm. But oh. um, but at least I think that's what happened. Oh, I know. Now, don't forget, and, please, everybody, you know, help us out. You know, if you are wearing a hood or if you do have something that is scripted, please go ahead and remove it because you don't need it in here. You know, tummy toppers and pixel pickers and, yeah, please don't. Simply put, you ain't getting any over here. At least not up here. You want yeah. to get some? I mean, I mean, downstairs is free to you. But, uh, yeah, we won't uh, discuss about that. It looks Ooh. like uh, it looks like John picks up Kurt, but I think I think Kurt I think Kurt is a uh, Kurt's hurt, but John really really wants to you know he wants to put yeah. the money on him, basically. Goodness, I and, don't know. And 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 knowing John, he probably wants revenge, and he probably wants to break an arm or two. As it looks like John is trying to toss Kurt to the to the ropes. Uh -huh. Or, 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 or oh, that might he just toss it right to the corner post. Mm. Don't know. I mean, it, it's something else. I don't know I who's going to do what. This thing is still evenly matched. I agree with that. It looks like John, look, Chris, Chris, right now at the bottom of the corner right now. And looks yeah. like John won't, and John. John needs to be careful, because uh, if, if if he lets Kurt, if he lets Kurt if he lets Kurt take one just one chance at him, that could be it. And there we go. As I said that, as Kurt comes out with a stiff open hand palm strike, 
not that many wrestlers know how to even use that move. Wow. As, a, as, as effectively as Kurt. And wait a second, Kurt's going to the top turnbuckle. Oh, I do right not... Uh -uh. I, know, I do... I do not see this often. You do not see Cooper Bassett go to the top of a oh! I see. Oh my god! Oh, that hurt me! I mean, Gee, has hurt him. Is, yeah, John, this is not. No. Oh my god! As, wow. as, as, as Kurt hit that. Kurt that diving double foot stop. Oh Jesus. my. Yeah. Uh, ow! Yeah. That hurt me as, oh my god, Kurt comes out of nowhere with that irresistible ending. And I oh, think wow. that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Once Kurt hits that, that's usually the one, two, three. Oh, and there we go. Can. One, two, three. And ladies it's three. Gentlemen, yep, ladies and gentlemen, your word for tonight's match is the, irresist the irresistible one, Kurt Bombastic. As he goes, nice try, kids. Well, I mean, he did do a good match, and I can't say he didn't, so... You know, at least it was, you know, pretty good. Fairly good. I, I will give him that much. Although I may not have to like it, but, yeah. I mean, it looks like Kurt definitely, uh... respected John right after that match. As he just yeah. nods and just walks away. And John is... John is hurt. That irresistible ending could do a number on you. Yeah, that's true. I was like, John's trying to stand up, but he is, he is dazed out of his mind right now. Hey, John, you alright, man? Okay, John. You're seeing double. And oh dear, no, it looks like he's not right. Oh my. Am I, John? Man, just to land on his feet somehow. Yep, and he has to fight another day. I believe it. That was a tough match. Definitely. I'll like, say, ladies and gentlemen, it looks like, uh, I don't know, we already did sponsors, donations, and all that stuff, so, ladies and gentlemen, we're moving on to our main event of the evening, so, ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise! <laughs> Like the crowd is just going wild, eh? Hey, Dixie! Ready? I believe they are! One. I am wait, so ready wait, for this one. Hold up, wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, this... Yeah. I wasn't this expecting it. Like no, I know it's not, as I do hear the familiar music. And this gonna be one man coming out to this music. Uh-uh. He's not scheduled tonight. He's not. But but he's here. We hear his music. Oh Kirk Lions, really? Yep, as we are greeted uh. by the Bave Machine and the APW uh, champion, Maven Gothley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this man has been very dangerous as of lately. <laughs> 
So anything is bound to happen. And he's bound to say anything, so. Yep, let him have his time. Greatly appreciate if you let me have my time. Now, um, now as you can see, this belt over my shoulder, I, I haven't had to talk, got to talk much since Night of Destiny. I mean, I said my bit on fuel, but here on Ignition, I haven't said shit. And I just got one thing to say. Well, first off, I got one thing to say. I told you so. I told you I'm in the best shape of my career. I told you I'd win that. And people, uh, people ask me, well, why would you go after Kurt? You know, why would you take the bell off Kurt? And I, my answer to that is, you know, he's gotten soft, okay? He gave me my props, and you know what? I have respect for the guy. But, but in all honesty, I think I'm the one to represent this company. <sighs> Yeah, uh, and and I see you might be a little bored over there. Maybe you might have something to say. I mean, I know Scott's in the hospital and all. And while you know, you, you know, maybe you might think I have something to do with it. So I'd like to hear what you got to say. Oh, you, say you want to hear what I have to say? Yeah, you go turn ahead. around. Come on Maven. in here, Maven. You turn around and you came after me. Uh, Dixie. You came after me. <laughs> so Wrong your point move, is, buddy. What's your point, man? What is your point? My point is, you want to come after me? Let me get in that ring with you. I've already taken on one man that told me oh, that the uh, uh, place was supposed to be barefoot and pregnant uh, and uh, in the kitchen. Uh, uh, oh, Captain you, Falcon. What, what, you think you could step in the ring with me? Do you really oh, want to I'll risk yourself like you that? Want me to. I would twist you in half, woman. Don't you even you think, think for one second I'm above putting you out. Okay, oh, I would really? twist you in half. Uh, yeah, okay, Dixie, come on here. up in here. I dare you. Come on up here. Uh, Dixie, okay. yeah, uh -huh. Dixie, Dixie, don't. Yeah, okay. Dixie, don't. That, yeah, that's uh -huh. a bad idea. That is not a bad idea. Because I'm going to tell you one thing, Maven. I am going to tell you one thing, and one thing only. Now, there is a lot of men that are true men. Come out from that back, if you even thought to really hurt me. You know that? What's over. You yeah, know? I'm just waiting for you to give me a reason. That's all I need oh, is one to reason. give you a reason? <laughs> really? Yes, give me a reason. Give you a reason. Why would I want to give you a reason? You turn around and you have no balls because you cannot turn around and win a match without someone else's help. I've won plenty of matches without other people's help. The last time oh. I held this title, the last time I held the world title here in APW, oh. I won the match by myself. Oh, really? Really? Yeah. Every match I've won here, I've done it under my own power, under my own ability. And if you think for one second that I am weak. Yeah, you're weak. Well, then you're sadly mis- you're, you're weak. Because for one, you, think you can't turn around and come in and win a match without coming and trying to hurt I mean, really, well, you, can, you really want to do that? Well, you know what? You, you're entitled to your own opinion. Oh. And whatnot. I, I'm I still entitled have this to my own opinion? Yeah, you're entitled yeah. to your own opinion. But you know what? All, all that matters. <laughs> you you know, have all that to matters. come after me. You know what? It wouldn't uh, have mattered if I came at you or not. Scott would have lost either way. Unlike me, he's not man enough to do what needs to be done. To what needs to be done to be on top. Yeah, okay. Uh, that may be true. That may not be true. But you want to know something? At least he would never hit a woman or even go after a woman. Uh, but uh, unlike Dixie. you, you cannot turn around and say that you would never have hit me. 
Uh, Dixie. I uh, can't say that. I guess you're right. That's right. Because you would have hit me. But my point yeah. is, I'm willing to do what needs to be done to be the man. Yeah, you think? You really Scott think? You, you know what, I'm done here. Uh, you know what, I'm done yeah, here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I've right. said what you, I needed to say. You and your big mouth, and that's all you can do. Oh. Mouth, mouth, mouth. That's all you want to do. Uh, Dixie. And by the way, when it comes by, the to way a woman. By, by the way, Dixie, tell, ne next time you go visit Scott in the hospital, uh huh. tell, tell yeah. him I said I'm waiting for him. Oh, really? You're waiting for him? Uh, what's wrong? Don't you think you can turn around and, and beat him on, you know, Common ground, one on one, right here in this ring. I'll make certain of that. You know, I, I can make certain that he needs to have do you really time to take you on. Okay, let me get. Let me ask you a little question, Dixie. Uh, okay. Yeah. Sure. Fine. Uh, do you do you really want to push me? I am five Dixie. Three. Dixie. Dixie. I am one hundred and forty pounds. Do you think I can Dixie. turn around and uh, push you? Yeah. Uh, oh God. Yeah. Dixie, so. Dixie, uh -huh. Dixie, Dixie, Dixie. What? No, no, that, that's not a good idea. All he is is mouth. <laughs> that's all he is, is mouth. Uh, wait, uh, wait, uh, Maven, Dixie, um, look at the ramp. Oh! oh wait, holy shit. Wait, wait, yeah. wait, don't, don't do it. Oh. Oh, God. Oh Lord. Oh Jesus. I hope you're happy. Wait a sec, wait. <laughs> I really hope you're happy. Damn you, Maven. Wait, uh, Dixie, Dixie, are you, you okay? <clears throat> Where do you think you're going, Gosley? You thought for one second I didn't see that? Hey, you and okay? you really thought for one second that I cared? Well, we'll see how much you care, Maven. For your actions, you are hereby suspended without pay oh, for two oh. weeks. Suspended? Oh, God. Oh, 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 you yeah, made a big mistake, man. Yes. You really hey. have, Brawly. You just I... wait. Oh. Hey, 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 take it easy, take it easy, take it easy. Hey, all right, just take it oh. easy. Take it easy, just, just. Just, just walk, just walk to, just uh, walk, you know, just walk, just walk. Come on, let's go. Uh, no, uh, get her to, get her to yeah. medical, get her to medical. Uh, yeah, I will, I will. Hey, come on, come uh, on, Dixie, come on, let's go. I'll be all right. Let's go. Let's go. I'll be okay. I've taken on uh, tougher people than Maven. Yeah, that's all right. That's all right. Come on, let's go. Ah. Uh, Thank you Let's very go. much. I'll be back out I'll be back out here, John. Yeah, I just need you though. Know, just need to make sure that she's good. Uh, I'll be back here with Shy. I mean Thank Baldi. you. No, no, I, sorry. Oh god. Oh shit. There's another lawsuit. Oh damn it. Um shit. Shit 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 shit. Um, Baldi, I tried, I tried, I tried everything I could. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, well, hopefully Maven will learn his lesson about going off on people without and laying his hands on the women of the APW roster. Seriously, I mean, I mean, in all seriousness, I'm not happy. Yes, I guess I, I, I understand. I wouldn't imagine anybody, any fed owner that would be happy about that. I, I definitely know. I mean, we, I mean, is it under contract that we don't get attacked and we can't attack, you know, them? I mean, for commentary? But yeah. Um, ladies and gentlemen, uh, the show has to go on. So we're going to move on to our main event, ladies and gentlemen. So please, if you can, you make some noise. Main event style there? 
Uh, what? Maybe maybe it's so. Oh hell yeah! Yeah, I'll do. I'll do a maybe so. Yeah. So yeah, how how does this work again? Do I have to stand here and you know get wait for people to come out and then announce them and stuff like that, or yeah. do I just you know? Okay, okay, okay. I can do that. I can do that. I can do that. Oh god. I am surrounded. You <laughs> are surrounded by boobs. Get used to it. Okay, okay. I'll 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 try to do. So, uh okay, how do I do this? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's just this thing first. <laughs> From Kyoto, Japan, at a height of 5'7", weighing 125 pounds, she is Tammy Natsume! And, dear god. Um, and also, hi Stacy. Falcon, Falcon, keep I'll, your I'll, mind I'll, I'll, on I'll, the... I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to! <laughs> it's so hard! Okay, okay, I can definitely get this one. I can definitely get this one. And hi, um, <laughs> introducing her opponent from us. Uh, she escaped from a pound in Mexico, weighing 130 pounds at a height of five foot eleven. She is La Gata Loca, <laughs> and I am going to, I'm going to try to hide. I'm going to try to calm myself. Calm myself. Uh, 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 Stacy. Uh, 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 Hi, Stacy. Um, yes. What What do you want? What do you want? Falcon, get your butt back here. Uh, Quit flirting with I, the women. I, I, I know she did. You... Uh. 
It's okay if I could retire and become Stacy's manager. Uh, keep your hands above the table, Falcon. I'm, I'm, I'm well, yeah, of course, but uh, dear God. <laughs> As uh, this match is What's undergoing the as difference between these two, we actually found someone smaller than Gata. Uh, wait, smaller or larger? Uh, I mean, I mean, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Smaller. God <laughs> damn it, Falcon! <laughs> as as uh, yeah, Tammy uh, goes, uh, 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 <laughs> anyway, uh, we try to get back to the match here. <laughs> As like Sultan Lakata has, has to... Yes. And... As she... <laughs> oh, boy, I love... You need a new commentator? I'm dead! <laughs> as it looks like... As it looks like... Lakata Loka has... Has Tammy down. As looks like always, and Tammy looks like she's heading back up. Oh. <laughs> yes, yes, oh. it is a headlock okay. takedown. Yeah, there we go, I think we're ready. <laughs> I think so too. And I'm sorry, Tommy I'm sorry. Tommy was the kick to the gut. I'm not good, as Tammy, Tammy is Tommy, the... Tammy? Tommy? It's, ta it's Tammy. She's showing off her assets as... as dear God. You know, you are making it very difficult to commentate this match right now, kid. You're buying up the boobs and not the wrestling. I'm sorry that she has F size. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> anyway, Legata looks like she's definitely taking control of Natsuda. She, oh, she punches her. That's not very nice. Oh. I was like, she'd go for yeah, it. Oh, I got to go for a scoop slam! Well, since you two can't con concentrate on this match, and since apparently I'm sitting in your chair, since you obviously lost your man card because you're scared to be surrounded by boobs, excuse me while I blow the smoke in your face. Uh, I was. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll just like, comment. I'll, I'll just like, curtain. That uh, feels good. We got a great match here between Lagata Loka. And, um, who is this person? Who is this, this, this Japanese, what is this, Japanese girl or something? I don't know. <laughs> yes. Tommy Natsumi. Tommy Natsumi. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> never seen her, ne believe it or never, I've never heard of her before. Well, you could, uh, you see, he needs this pink chair because he's obviously lost his man card, Broly. Did you see anyway, <laughs> back to the, Oh! She got a oh. suplex, but no! Counter! That was a very nice suplex reversal there, uh, by, uh, what's, what's her name again? Tammy. Kama? Tammy, as uh, uh, she Tammy. DTs Legata on her bunny ears. Well, you know, it, what's this like here that she's like, um, what is it, some, something escaped from Mexico? She's part bunny, part kitty. She's some pound escaped in, in some. She yeah, she's but some she's a. I don't know. She's a uh, she's a she's a chimera. She's what really? Wow. You're scared of boobs, yet you you talk about okay. We know where your priorities are. Anyways, <laughs> gotta coming off the ropes here. Huge kick to the gut as well, and well, oh, oh, and, oh, oh, and a drop oh, kick to the face. Yes, drop, <coughs> drop kick right to the face. Lots of bunny ears around here today, I notice. Yep, as <laughs> yeah, lots comes of Tammy. bunnies too, might I add. <laughs> oh, tomorrow is Easter. We got a bunny here, there a bunny, here a bunny, there a bunny, everywhere a bunny. So it's it's Easter Claus. It's definitely Easter as Lakata's wearing as where Lakata's wearing bunny ears and our lovely like ref is wearing a bunny suit. Ah, that's better. I mean look at that tail. Anyways, back to the match. Lakata's still down. She must have gotten hit hard enough to I think so. As what is this? What's this by Tammy? What's this? Like some kind of flip. 
Didn't get it. Didn't. See. see. Oh, 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 no. oh! Moonsault. Did you see that? She actually she did a moonsault, but she lit, she she landed on her head, almost like a moonsault flying headbutt thing. I don't know what the hell that was. That was, that was a it looked like a handspring moonsault to me. See, there are more than boobs, you little One, man. One, two, no! We gotta still kick out. You know, I. Well, I mean, is, I mean, I can't just say the size of that. Oh, oh, wait a second! Look at this! Uh, oh, pin roll! One, One, two, no! Can't, ca oh. can't catch got her uh, uh, off like that. She gets her Indeed. inspiration by licking her tattoos. Oh, they're made out of candy, are they? <laughs> I walked past candy her earlier today, and, and they had that can she had that candy smell going on. It was weird. <laughs> I saw I saw her licking them too, so I don't I don't. I don't know, but they uh, call her the Sugar Queen now. The Sugar Queen. Don't don't give her any. Well, it, it's like I explained before the show. Just a man. Well, it's like um, you had to mention Sugar. Now she's all motivated. But well, either way, uh, got a, <laughs> a whip to the r corner there. <laughs> Now she's doing some corner knee strikes. Explaining before the show, if you probably go to her locker and open it up, you'll probably get oh. consumed by a giant tsunami of candy. Indeed, as little like Lagada has uh, Tammy at the ropes as she holds onto her chest. And uh, oh. pounding away right now. Yeah, as Lagada hitting that ten count. Very classy. Well, God is very is very good, and she's been waiting for this moment for a long time. This is actually her first main event that she's wrestling, so she, you know, yes. she's not going to disappoint. <laughs> I mean, oh, she, the God of, she, she even requested well, this in right crayon. Now, I've seen it. Well, the God right now using oh. some questionable tactics. Yeah, God is showing a little bit of a vicious streak in there. Uh, maybe that those bunny ears are gotten to her or something. I don't know. Is that a bunny tail she's wearing? Seriously? Well, I mean, I mean, cats have claws. She's yeah, but a she's cabbage. a bunny. <laughs> but so she's you a not bunny. see the ears? <laughs> I see the no, ears, but she's a cabbage. Why you're why you're bit too busy covering your eyes, Falcon, away from the boobs? You know no, they, no, 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 they no, no, have no. other parts too. <laughs> No, 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 I understand, I understand they have some assets. By the way, we're, we're incinerating your man card, but just so you know. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, got it going for the pin. One, One two. two. <laughs> oh, yeah, two count. <laughs> and, uh... What, do you look, when you look at my wife, you think she looks disgusting? Do I have to, do I have to hurt you now? But you have to look at wait, my wait. Valentine, you think she's disgusting, too. Wait, is it? Wait, is it? Hold up, hold up, hold up. I, I, now you just I put words out of my mouth. Wait, 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 wait. Just, just because I enjoy, um, uh, I'm gonna stop. He doesn't want you to stop, yeah. Slade. No, no, wait, 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 no, 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 those years of experience. Indeed, I mean, I haven't seen uh, Tammy fight. This is her debut, right? What's Stacy doing on ringside, by the way? Is she like a manager Appar or something? Apparently, yeah. she, is. she is. She's Tammy's manager. manager. Oh, okay. Oh, is... See, I'm, I'm too busy uh, focusing on being the main event player around here that you know, I don't know. What's the and, I mean, oh, I mean... interesting move Ooh. by uh, Gata. Just sends uh, Tammy down. That's that luchador style. That's very, that's very quick and very, uh, very good. Looks like Stacy's getting a little perturbed. That's Indeed. For years. <laughs> I mean, come on now. These women look pretty good. I mean, Stacy's in her bunny suit. The ref is in her bunny suit. Tammy is in. Uh, she hey, just Falcon, hold naked. out your hand for a second. Um. Okay. And that is out. Thank well, you. My... Okay, I, I had, I had to dump my ashes someplace. Oh, you asshole! Thank you. I know I am. Anyways, Tommy taking down Legata once again. That's a nice drop kick. Oh! It's ew. Well, nice, le nice leg drop by Tammy there. Those ashes were hot, man. 
Shit. They're ashes, you idiot. <laughs> Anyways, Legata punching away on Tommy right now. Tam Tammy, not Tommy. Tommy can't wait to wrestle here anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Tommy spelled differently. Oh, wait. Oh, got to hook it up. Uh, Tammy go has got her held up there. Hold up for quite a long time. And oh, drops her with authority. And Tammy's that a must have... person. Yeah, but yes, she's pretty she heavy. I mean, all the weight is... Uh, uh, now, now you're saying, now now you're saying she's heavy. <laughs> Really? First you're gawking out their boobs. Now you're now you're insulting them by calling them women heavy. You man, you're you're bad. Oh, 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 wait a minute. Five hundred. Oh, what was this? Sorry, sorry. Go ahead, Broly. That's what you call the final heavy stuff. Oh wait, hey, here comes here comes Tammy, and she hits the oh. She calls it the final heavy. Oh, which was basically the Busaku knee. Yeah, and I, I, in fact, I used that move last night, and that that you you know about, don't you? Well, you didn't get hit by it, but no. <laughs> one, two, and what? Whoa, 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 what? Not gonna. That, that's a that's a good move, but you're not gonna defeat a guy that easily. I've got nope. good, that, but that was a hell of a kick. By the way, how is your partner's uh, teeth after that match? <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I believe that was at another place, but this is APW. That's true. I, I, I just like being being an asshole. <laughs> See, that's uh, Legata. It, oh boy, and no, Tammy. Not, that's that's yeah. a bad thing to do, Tammy. That's a rookie mistake. If she's a yes, Japanese, she was ta taught in that Japanese style. She would have known. Indeed, as all she, know. She would have known that they that they beat that in, into you in the Jap in the Japanese schools to not make those mistakes. I know. Oh, it's a kendo stick too. <laughs> oh, both of them going afterwards with some right punches. But right now, God has got the she, you know she's got the upper hand and she's got the power and the strength, which is kind of unusual for. I know it's unusual for God to actually have it somewhat. And oh, I got a Karana there. <laughs> Or is that a kitty Karana? I, uh, I, I like it's a bunny Karana. Her Karana. Got a Karana. Candy Karana. Oh boy. What, what's cat in, in Mexico? <laughs> Gato. Other, Gato. Other, other, yeah. Other than food. I'm just saying. Oh boy. There goes Gato with a flying splash as she misses. Oh, that must have not felt good. Oh, not indeed. Wait, did, did she miss? And oh, you no. two kick, take it to the bedroom. We don't need to see that here. Yes, please. Leave those... Ex if you are wearing those types of parts, please remember not to use them during the show. You sick freaks. Yeah, you ain't getting any over here. Captain, I mean, uh, I am. Captain, Fal Captain Falcon will set up his camera in your bedroom later. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Anyway, back to the Anyways, Tam, uh, Tammy is, uh, she's leaning against the bottom rope. God is uh, just telling her to get up. Uh, I think she's ready to end this. I'm just waiting for, I mean, it looks like Stacy is going over to uh, give Tammy some advice. Like might be a little out of it. I don't think that's. I don't think her yelling is a vice. You know, there's, she looks more pissed off than anything. Well, I mean, Tammy's trying to get up, but uh, um, uh, I can't say it. <laughs> you want what? You gonna say she's top heavy? Yeah. How hard was that to say? Oh, you said for it. As oh, what do you think you are, a Boy Scout? Gotta go for how sweet it is! Right, you're going for the pen! <laughs> too close right to the close. ropes! Wait, that's too close to the ropes as the ref looks I don't, like well, a... No, she but yeah, oh, got her! I don't know, I think Gata uh, had her Gata. legs hooked! Smart wrestling by Gata and she gets the victory yeah. here! And and oh gentlemen, shit! Your winner, Gata Loca! That's that sweet, sweet candy from the Gata Loca! 
since this is her first main event, and our, not only her first main event, but our main, main event victory, doesn't she get extra candy for that? Oh, um, my who? Well, she's trying, she's trying to uh, tell uh, Tammy, good match. She kind of just nice. Like me, I'm not she is. What a match it was. Well, if you ask me, I'm going to go well, check in the I'm... back because after what we saw uh, with Maven there, and people said I was an asshole. Well, I am, but, you know. By the way, I had oh, nothing to do me. with any Hopefully... of that. Uh, when he, he doesn't get a paycheck for the cu uh, pa next couple of weeks, maybe he'll think twice. Eh, he, he, he lured you into that, Broly. Remember, he's got the belt. <laughs> um, if you don't mind, I'm going to check on Tammy and Stacy. I mean, I'm just... Anyways! Yeah. Please... Please. Keep what? it in the pants. But well, anyways, well, since you know uh, they left poor Broly high and dry here, Broly, I'll stay, stay with you. Uh, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I am APW President Broly Blackheart. And I am the main event player. And this is me, Captain speaking. Who's actually perving on the on the girls? Uh, hey, hey, hey. Yes, you're a pervy captain indeed. Good fight. Good night. Yeah. Oh, but Don't forget that we're fight. back next week. This video was filmed on location by Zarakan Productions. Zarakan Productions is an umbrella group for many YouTube shows and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to zarakan.com for a complete listing of shows and businesses associated with Zarakan Productions and their own media links. Zarakan Productions shows have been organized alphabetically in playlists in a year, month, day format for easier video navigation. Multiple part videos have been named accordingly starting with part 1, and the last video of a multiple part video series will have end as a part of its title. Please like, comment, and share this video as it helps both Zarakan Productions, and the creators of this video's content. Also. Be sure to check the playlists for past episodes of show content, and subscribe to this channel for future videos. Thank you for watching, and happy wandering.